solve new problems. That's what we need to do. We need to solve new problems. Uh, we need to solve problems that um, you know others are not thinking uh, to solve, right? And we need we need to solve problems that are not just um, you know what is the low hanging fruit that you know is very easy to implement on blockchain technology but uh, we need to go out and find the really hard problems and then uh, think about how to um, adjust the technology uh, to to solve those problems you know in in a way that's consistent with um, of course, you know, the, the principles and the ethos uh, of Bitcoin Cash and all that, you know. Um, you know, and this is really like a listening activity, right? It's not the kind of thing where you can uh, either just sit back and see, you know, what other projects are doing, crypto projects are doing either. Um, this is really a project where you know, a, a task where you have to kind of also turn down your ego, right? So you can actually hear, um, you know, you have to go out and see into the real world and see what kind of, um, you know, monetary financial problems people are experiencing and, um, you know, come up with, with, with potential ways forward to solve them, right? Because every problem that we're able to solve uh, with Bitcoin Cash is new people that have a real reason to have uh, to create economic activity on uh, the BCH ledger, um, and that's that's really what the name of the game is, right? I mean, we can do you know like uh, you know some rare breed, what like Rottweiler coin, you know. Uh, you know, the 99th dog coin uh, token and, you know, hype the crap out of that and, you know, airdrop it to like 5 million anonymous, uh, you know, airdrop beggars. But, you know, like where, what, what real value, um, I'm not sure what the real value is there, right? Um, I mean, I'm sure there's some, but I'm not sure what it is. Uh, I'm not sure that that's really going to lead anywhere either, right? Um, but if you can go out there and find uh, new problems, uh, solve them, be the first to solve them, develop a reputation as the first to solve many real problems, then that, that starts building momentum and that gives people, uh, you know, a, a use case for Bitcoin Cash that they can't solve anywhere else. And those problems are absolutely out there. They're absolutely out there. We just have to go out and find them. And, uh, you know, sometimes people say to me, like, why? God damn it. Do you really you are onboarding more merchants? I mean, come on. But you know what? When you go out into the real world, particularly the developing world, uh, and you uh, introduce, um, you know, new people to uh, Bitcoin Cash and, you know, you look at, you know, you ask them what challenges they're experiencing. You learn information that really nobody else has, right? It's, it's like having a, a local uh, laboratory, right? Uh, it's like a research operation. Um, and, you know, I think that if you look back at the history of technology, computers, uh, etc., it's really the R&D, you know, it's really those operations that invest into research and development that come up with the uh, groundbreaking um, innovations, you know. And so we, we as, a, as a community, as a nation, uh, we're going to need to think about that. You know, um, we're going to need to have a perspective that is uh, beyond just, uh, you know, the, the 99th uh, Dogecoin uh, on, you know, BSC or the latest hype or, or the latest uh, fake stuff, you know, and, um, and, and really, you know, establish for ourselves what we're doing. You know, we're doing research and development. We're serving real world, real people, real problems. And, um, you know, just step beyond 
the limits of the current crypto ecosystem. So um, solve real problems on Bitcoin Cash.